Asian Dow breaks down in tears after receiving negative energy on how she's mourning the passing of boyfriend King Von. They said, they said go to my door because I got, um, they sent me, I'm going to put y'all flowers on her. They sent me flowers and they sent me chocolate, covered strawberries and stuff like that. I'm doing good, y'all. I'm not even going to lie. I was just going to get on this bitch and do this in, but, um, at the end of the day, like, fuck all that shit. My, my, Von probably just came into me and was like, don't do that shit, ma. Because I was going to do in. Like, I was finna really do in and have, and, like, do the, bro, I was finna do the fuck in. Oh, my mama, don't ever fucking play with me, especially not me. Don't ever play with me. Don't ever play with me or disrespect me. Because y'all know what's up with me. Y'all already know what's up with me. Y'all know how I was coming behind him. Y'all know that shit. Anyways, so, yeah, I, I've been, yeah, it's been good, though. Even though, um, it's a lot of shit going on. This not affecting me. It's not. It's not. It's not. The, the negativity not affecting me. As long as I think positive and think positive about the situation, I'm straight. I'm going to be straight. I'm going to be straight. I can live with me having my boy best entries, me never snaking him, me never going behind his back. I, I can live with just being a real big source him, even the, even the ups and downs. Even when my loyalty wasn't deserved, I still was loyal. And at the end of the day, I wasn't on good terms with with um none of the but we really like I really wasn't one the type of person who was just like who goes around the family or who is like you know with the kids and stuff like that I never I, I didn't it was I didn't never do that so it's like for me to just like gang like if I would I, when 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 Vaughn died me and Vaughn was not going together we was not together so for me to just step up gang and just go and hug everybody make sure everybody straight talk to the kids, play with the kids, and I'm just talking so, you know, just talking with my emotions and shit like that. Everybody's, it is what it is. We see, you see, y'all see. It is what it is. And if anybody play on me when it comes to like spiritually, like making a joke out of me saying that I talk to Vaughn spiritually, like just, you will see. Like, you know, everybody has their day. And this shit not a joke. It's not funny. I'm not fucking delusional. I'm not losing my mind. Like, I'm coming to reality. And that's what's bringing me so much peace and so much joy. And that's the, that's the reason why I, I haven't crashed out. That's the reason why I haven't been so emotional like I was the first two days. That's the reason why. Because, like, I'm facing reality. And if nobody know, me and Vaughn knew that. I'm, I, I'm, I'm ten toes down. During, during why you leaving, why you living... And after you leaving, like you feel me? So I'm, I'm gonna do what I'm supposed to do. I'm gonna play my part. I'm gonna play my position. I ain't let none of these lame man run me away from none of that shit no more. Give a fuck. I'm around. I'm, it's, it was up, Queen Von, and that's what the fuck it is. And I'm Queen Von, and nobody gonna never be able to take that from me. No fucking body, none. I don't give a fuck what nobody say, and that's just what it is. And, I, and I'm woman enough to get on this to say that me and Von was not together when he died. Me and Ron was not together when he died. Y'all seen what happened. Y'all seen the internet stuff. But y'all seen how I'm carrying this shit on my shoulders, on my motherfucking back. Because if that shit, me and Vaughn would have not been together. If something happened to me or my mama, Vaughn would have had my family. Vaughn would have reached out to my family. Vaughn would have stood right there with my mama, head up. My boy would have made sure my family was straight. My boy would have made sure my family. And it's, that's, that's all that fucking matters. Literally. Literally, and if anybody on this playing with me and, and, and making jokes about this, shit, this is not this is not funny. This shit is real. This shit is my life, and this shit is reality. Like this is my life now. Like y'all don't understand. This shit is really my fucking life. Like y'all don't think I get up in the morning and I just I, I'm I'm surprised too. Like who the fuck wanna go through some shit like this? Who wanna go? Who wanna see they they get killed on camera? And people run like who wanna see that? Don't nobody wanna see that? Don't nobody wanna get on this crying? But stop playing with me like stop, stop playing with me just because I'm on this speaking the truth. Don't ever in your in your life play with me, bro. In my loyalty when it came to him, y'all knew I wasn't with that boy. Y'all knew what the fuck was up. Y'all was down with that shit. Y'all 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 was for that shit. We wasn't together. Y'all was really for that shit. It, it made y'all so happy to see me and that shit not together. Stop playing. Stop playing. We didn't. He didn't leave. On the, he didn't leave with. No animosity towards me. Y'all seen what that boy said. He said, long as Asia happy, I'm happy. And that's type of 
that I had, and I'm a real bitch, and I'm gonna stand the fuck up for him, his family. I'm gonna be there for whoever, whoever. And I would have never left his side. I would have never left his side. And everything happened for a reason because I'm alive and I'm here to speak the fucking truth. And you need to shut the fuck up. If y'all ain't gonna go step or do something, stop coming for me. Go do something. Stop work. Stop trying. To, stop trying to put pieces together and say what started the beef. Stop fucking playing because y'all know. And I ain't even really. And I'm not even really like, bro. I don't know, negative shit, like, I, I, I'm i really, like, thinking positive still, but it's just simple fact, like, dang, you, out of all people track, you gonna go, you gonna go live with this academics gang, like, you really gonna do that shit, and you know damn well with me and Vaughn broke up two gang, I'm so motherfucking loyal, I'm so, I'm so motherfucking loyal gang, when, when, when I got, when I stopped, when I had got, um, wanted to leave Gucci, think about it, my nigga, how this nigga, I wanted to, I wanted to just stay in the loop, even if me and Vaughn went together, like, so what, nigga? Y'all all knew about me before that. Like, it, it is what it is. Like, like I even came to you, Track. What I asked you? What I asked you? I said, manage me. What I asked you? Then I asked you to manage me. Then I asked you to take me in. Then I come to the fuck your fucking office and sit down with your gang. And y'all probably thought that shit was funny. Y'all probably was laughing at my pain. Laughing at the fuck up situation I was in. And guess what you did? You you spit me. You ain't even say nothing back, gang. We, we, was, we was cool, cool. Cool, cool. I came to you this gang and asked you like I came to you. Stop playing. Stop playing. I'm at the end of the day, gang, I'm Asian dog. And that's just period. And I'm raw and I've been in this shit. Everybody been with me. Girl. For real. Yeah, that's all ain't be great. Yeah, I ain't mean to cry. I didn't even wanna get on this crying. I look like this is this this not what it is, but in them be there for my boy family, his kids, baby mamas, cousins, aunties, nieces, nephews, whatever, sister, whatever. And that's all I'm here for, cause I didn't, I, we, he didn't, he, we didn't, we wasn't, we wasn't going together. And that's why they so happy to say ex girl can get y'all lame. So all y'all was on my mother when I came around. Stop playing in my church. Stop playing with me. All oh, y'all don't ever play with me. Talking about some heavy on the ex-girlfriend. Heavy on the ran. What are you talking about? Everything that I saw and I said, everybody in the whole world seen that shit. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. You on this bitch talking about some she talking to Vaughn through her spiritual. Is that like who like who is you to sit here and play, gang? You wouldn't even never play like that. Even if me and Vaughn was on the worst of terms, gang, you would never in your life sit there and do an interview about me, gang. If he was alive, you could never do that shit. Why you wanna do that shit? He died. That's how you know you is disrespectful as fuck. You don't got no motherfucking, you don't got no motherfucking respect. Y'all didn't have respect for him. Y'all didn't have respect when the shit went down. Y'all sure don't have respect after the fact. And that's just period. Any nigga on that talking about and they family and all, stop playing. Know your place. Sit the fuck down in that wheelchair. Know your listen to y'all. And I'm, I'm finna get out this shit again because uh, I feel like I'm doing too much. But at the end of the day, but at the end of the day, like, I'm a real bitch. I don't have to speak on it. I don't have to say it. I stand on it. Everybody know what's going on. And just like, leave me the f alone. Thanks for tuning in to 9MAG TV.